In competitive Generation 3 Pokemon, Wobbuffet is banned from standard play. Shadow Tag is that powerful of an ability. But it may surprise you to know that in the Uber's tier, the tier of legendary Pokemon, while Wobbuffet is itself not banned, Leftovers is banned on Wobbuffet and Wynut. The reason is because of struggle. If a Wobbuffet or a Wynut were to meet with another Wobbuffet, Shadow Tag would lock both Pokemon in the game, meaning neither Pokemon can switch. Wobbuffet is famously known for not having any attacking moves, which means that all they do versus each other is do nothing and waste power points. But the misery doesn't end there. Once you do run out of power points, you start to struggle. But in Generation 3, struggle and its recoil depends on your attack stat. This is different from now, where struggle always has 25% recoil. Wobbuffet has a really low attack stat, which means that when it starts to struggle, it's so weak that it doesn't do enough damage to outdamage leftovers. If a Wobbuffet with leftovers would ever fight another Wobbuffet with leftovers, it would turn into a literally infinite game because leftovers heals more than struggle damages. The decision was made to ban leftovers specifically on Wobbuffet and why not, so that infinite battle situations would never happen. A common question is why not just tie the game and rematch it if it were to happen? But in general, ties are avoided as much as possible because a big part of singles gameplay is a surprise factor. If you have to rematch, you lose that team's surprise factor and a leftovers ban was deemed better than causing a tie. Fortunately, entering Generation 4, there was a mechanic change. Starting in Gen 4, Shadow Tag Pokemon could escape an opponent's Shadow Tag, which meant a Wobbuffet could switch out of another Wobbuffet. Because of that, Leftovers was unbanned on Wobbuffet entering Gen 4, thus ending the end of an era. Thanks for watching, and if you like Gen 3, check out the time I did a Nuzlocke of Pokemon Emerald without using evolutions.